About four or five years ago, I designed and built a remote ignition system designed around a mousetrap. That project has either been misplaced or probably broken, so the other night, I built a new one. The design is fairly simple. It is a mousetrap mounted to a piece of quarter inch plywood. Attached to the mousetrap's arm is a piece of brass tubing. A match will eventually go into this brass tubing. Suspended above the mousetrap is a matchbox striker pad. The striker pad is held in place on one end by a wooden stand and on the other end by some rubber bands. I also attach to the piece of plywood a small alligator clip. This is to hold a fireworks fuse in place when I'm using the ignition system. To use the remote ignition system, you pull back on the mousetrap's lever. While holding the lever down, you stick the trigger pin through an ice screw, over the lever, and through the other ice screw. When you're ready to use the ignition system, you'll pull this pin out real fast. Once the lever is held down, you then slip a match into the brass tube. Now, when you're ready, you go ahead and pull the trigger pin. When you pull the trigger pin, it will release the mousetrap lever. This will cause the lever to sling forward, striking the match head against the matchbox striker pad, and this will light the match. Here is a quick demo of the ignition system in action. Here it is again. Watch how the rubber bands provide a springiness to the striker pad. Although I think the ignition system is cool, it's not the most practical. First of all, it doesn't work outside in the wind well, and also, getting it to light every time is difficult. With that said, I still think it was fun to build and play with. If you would like to see more information on this, there's a link in the description to where I wrote about it on my blog. If you like projects like this, be sure to check out my website, backroomworkdesk.com, and thanks for watching.